Hello, my name is Paul from Packbreak, and today I will be showing you how to read and diagnose error codes that you may experience on your PH3 system. PH3 error codes are used for troubleshooting purposes and are included on all automatic PH3 kits. It is important that you are able to read your error codes so that we can help assist you as fast as possible when you call into Packbreak support. Here we can see the switch panel for a normally operating PH3 system that is programmed and reading an engine speed signal. The green light will flash every 5 seconds to indicate the system is active and a speed signal is being detected. Once the engine is shut off, no lights will flash. Here we see the switch panel for a PH3 system that is in an error code state. The error code is displayed to the user by an initial rapid alternating flash of the red and green lights, followed by a number of simultaneous flashes of both lights. The number of simultaneous flashes corresponds to the error code. The sequence of flashes will continue until the issue is remedied and power is reset. Each error code is a specific diagnostic code that allows the user to identify an issue within their system. When the system is displaying an error code, the automatic and manual trip teachers are disabled and will not function for engine shutdown. It is imperative that you contact PowerHalt customer support to immediately rectify the issue. In this particular case, the system is showing 11 simultaneous flashes. This corresponds to error code 11, which indicates that the valve motor is disconnected. Code 11 is most commonly due to the 2-pin connector not being fully seated and locked to the control module. When the connector is not fully seated and locked, it can become loose due to vibration and then become disconnected. To remedy the issue, we must securely connect the 2-pin connector until it clicks and locks. Now that we have solved this particular issue, we must cycle power to the system in order to clear the error code. To do so, you must find the 15 amp fuse for your system located either at your battery terminals or at your power distribution center. Once you have found the fuse, remove it for 30 seconds and reinstall. Thank you for watching. Once you have identified the error code you are experiencing, contact PowerHawk customer support for help diagnosing it.